Hey guys, this is Alex Bruno. So welcome to my third video about the more premium pedal 012, the US Gold 100. So in this video we're checking out how good this premium pedal takes drive pedals. Alright, let's start. <laughs> Alright, let's start with the first pedal. The first pedal I've chosen uh, is the Boss Blues Driver. It's a tube screamer like pedal, it's quite common. So, this is my clean signal on the next single coil and on the humbucker. Okay, let's set this pedal up like a boost pedal. So, let's engage it. We're still on the bridge humbucker. Okay, let's go to the next single coil. The reverb you're hearing is coming from the Victory V40 Data Jazz amp, which I'm using for the power amp station. Okay, without the pedal. quite good. Let's turn the pedal off, take, bring everything to noon and this is the clean signal on the bridge humbucker again. Let's engage the pedal. Full. And do it halfway again. Next single coil. Okay, turn the pedal off. Let's set it to a boost again and go to drive channel. So this is the drive channel on the bridge humbucker. Turn the pedal on. Without the pedal, with the pedal, okay, let's switch to the next single coil, this is the next single coil, 
without the pedal. Let's engage the pedal. Okay, so what I think is that it likes to be boosted, like it's the same with every modeling piece of gear, but the clean channel takes the drive very well. So you could definitely use the blues driver in its clean channel. And it sounds good. It's alright for me. Okay, let's change for the next pedal. Okay, so I've changed the pedal to a max on OD808. It's also a tube screamer. It has a bit more silkier drive and it's very good for boosting stuff to tighten up some stuff. So let's see how this pedal works with the preamp. So I set it up as a boost again. So this is my clean tone the bridge humbucker. <laughs> Let's engage the pedal. Some kit here. So this works. To turn it off, go to the next single coil, clean tone. Engage it. seems to work pretty good. Let's go back to the humpaka. Clean. Set everything to noon. Catch the pedal. Back to noon and to the next single coil. Clean. Engage the pedal. Let's raise up the gain. really good. Turn the pedal off, set it to boost and go to drive channel. So this is the humpbacker drive channel without the pedal. Let's engage the pedal. Okay, 
works really good. Let's go to the next single coil without the pedal. <laughs> the pedal Let's turn it off. So I think this pedal also works very good, especially in the clean channel. And there's a boost also good into the drive channel. Let's swap to the next pedal. Okay, so now back again with the Earthquake Devices Acapulco Gold pedal, which is like um, a mixture of an extreme distortion and fuzz pedal. So to simulate the a Sun Model T amp which is melting down. It has a lot of volume and a lot of gain. So let's see how it, how this preamp pedal can handle this. All right. So Hampaka uh, Clean Town. Let's engage the pedal. because we're working with, with a very high signal, with a very loud signal, but this seems to work very good. Okay, let's turn it off, go to the next single coil, this is the clean tone next single coil, and engage the pedal. try with this pedal so because normally you use it with a little bit of drive on your amp so let's raise the gain on the clean mode this is how it sounds with the hapaka <laughs> Okay, 
to check, let's go to the drive channel with quad again. This is the humbucker without the pedal. Let's see if we can get this meltdown effect we want to achieve with such a pedal. So. like to get a bit of the wah effect. Wah. Check it out with the next single coil. Okay, so it definitely works good into the clean channel and as we put it into the drive channel with some gain to simulate that meltdown you would normally get with a tube amplifier. We got not the same effect than on a tube amp but it was kind of nice as well something different but kind of nice i liked it so from my opinion i think that the more premium pedal to your skull 100 does take pedals and they all they also sound pretty good for this preamp pedal i mean it will never sound the same than with a tube amp because you don't you don't get tubes to melt down you don't get that warmth you can't, don't get you don't get this feel but it it's really good and just to remember it costs under 100 bucks it's really good okay so i want to say thank you to everybody who was watching this video or perhaps my whole demo series about this pedal because I made with this video three videos about this pedal. The first one was with song demo in the mix, clean and drive. The second video was all about how it sounds through some different power amps and through some different caps. And yeah, this was my last video. So how does it take pedals? So what do you think? How does it take pedals? Do you like the sounds we've achieved with our free combinations? Please let me know in the comment section. And if you like the stuff I'm doing, if you like my videos and the, the way I do them, please hit that like, uh, that subscribe button. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.